Hey guys, Javano here, and uh, welcome to a new episode of Redstone for Dummies. Uh, this will be my first episode of my new sub-series I'm starting. It's still going to be classified under the Redstone for Dummies series, but it's going to be kind of a group of videos. And this was actually requested from me a uh, ooh, probably a month ago, I'd say, maybe a little bit more. And uh, that is to make a step-by-step uh, -step tutorial on how I was making my seven-segment display. And, uh, yes, this video won't be very, uh, substantial. It'll just basically be me showing you how to build the outline. It's, it's not really, it's more about the introduction of the series than it is actually, uh, the content of it. So, uh, let's get started. Uh, while I'm building this, uh, I would like to apologize for not being able to post as many videos, or any videos for that matter, the past couple weeks. Um... The reason for that, I'm not going to go over that again. It's just, uh, if you if you want to know why, and uh, just go check out my uh, channel update. I believe it was the video before this I posted. Uh, I'm doing it yeah, like that. But, uh, yeah, long story short, if you don't know what happened, um, circumstances have uh, caused me to be unable to uh, guarantee <coughs> my... Uh, or just a certain amount of videos. I will... Hopefully this is the last little uh, speed bump for a while, if you will. But I cannot guarantee I'll be able to post a video every single day, like I was before. I probably will be able to, but I will not guarantee it. Like, I will not promise it, because I cannot guarantee it. And this is a pretty simple thing here, honestly. It's pretty idiot-proof. I'm just doing this so I have uh, some way to introduce this plus talk about stuff type deal. Uh, I apologize if I don't seem as energetic as normal because uh, people are sleeping on the floor above me and I do not want to wake anybody. So I'm going to have to keep it down a tiny bit for this video. Uh, but I'm finally... I've really wanted to make another redstone for dummies. Uh, I just haven't... Well, one, I haven't been posting any videos for reasons I just specified. I was just looking at And, uh, two, I'm pretty much done the, um, uh, the, uh, main gate tutorials portion of it. Those need to go. Go up. But, uh, yeah, uh, I'm pretty much done the main gate tutorial part of it. Uh, I have a few more flip-flops to do, and that's really about it. So I'm gonna have to uh, I'm gonna have to ask you guys. Uh, I need more suggestions. Well, I don't need. I would uh, prefer more suggestions as to uh, what you guys want me to build more, so I can do more of those requested tutorial videos. I think I only have two of those up. I think I did a doorbell, and I can't remember what the other one was. But, um, I would love to do those for you guys. I am, mainly because I am running out of content for my, uh, Redstone for Dummies series. It is my biggest series, and, let me see one more. And it is, uh, basically what I'm well, most well known for. Because, uh, as you probably noticed, my speaking abilities aren't amazing. They're not terrible, but they could be better. I'm, I'm not really known for my commentary, so I'm just known for being ridiculous with redstone, hence why I try to prioritize this over my other videos. It's just when I don't really have any ideas of what to do, I kind of can't really make any videos, which is unfortunate. Oh no. Get some more dirt. Oh, I don't want grass, I want dirt. Now, um, you'll see I'm building on a very, very flat map. Uh, I can put the download link for this map in the description. It is the old map type, and I will not make a tutorial on how to install it unless you guys really want one. Uh, long story short, you copy and paste it as you would an old map, and then when you load it, Minecraft will convert it to the new map type thing. Uh, I'm not even sure what they call it. It's something weird. Uh, for this, it will just be a uh, this display. Back on topic. Um, it will just be three torch segments, and obviously seven segments. That's how it works. And let's go in here. Just need to back. Backing. 
have some good torches on. Yeah. And also, I highly recommend uh, this mod here. Everything you see here is too many items. You see that up here. Uh, that's what the mod's called, too many items. Uh, I'll put a link to the minecraftforms.net thread about that. I will probably not make an installation tutorial just because it's the same as you install any other mod, pretty much. Minecraft just decided to uh, minimize itself. But go over here. And there's the torches. Look, torches. Just gives you a stack of torches. Just like that. A very handy tool for when you're building stuff like this. Now, for those of you who don't really like cheating, honestly, as soon as you see how much redstone is required for this, you'll understand why. I, I don't really like cheating that much either, but the amount of redstone required for this is just ridiculous. It would take years to mine that much redstone. And we're almost done. Clean it up here. Good. Now we just need to put the torches in. Uh, but, uh, yeah, just as I was saying earlier, I'm just gonna repeat myself because this is very important. For me. Oh, and I'm also probably going to install a mod just to make the day permanent, because there's really no point to having night when you're doing creative stuff like this. Uh, but yeah, I would really appreciate if you guys, uh, if you ever want to learn how to build anything in Redstone, uh, send me a question. I have only turned down one idea, just because it was absolutely, it was pretty much impossible. Uh, it was to create, like, some kind of self-building wall. Where, um, but you can kind of make it now if you have the piston mod on, but... It's where, like, you wanted to have a castle-type thing, and then press a button, and a wall of gravel fell down around, which you could do. It's just it'd be really hard, and you have to manually reset the entire gravel wall, which would be a, way too big of a pain. But there we go. That's how you build this. Uh, zero programming to it yet, but I will get into this next video, I think. Depending on how fast I can do it, I'll probably get all the segments wired up to uh, one switch or torch or however I do it. So you'll have a line of seven torches, and depending on if it's on or off, it'll each, it'll each link to one segment. So there'll be one for this, one for uh, one for this here, one for this guy here, one for this, one for this, one for this. You get the idea. But yeah, that's about it. Thanks for watching. And also, a quick note, I've been getting a lot of subscribers, even though I haven't been posting any videos. and I thank you guys, and thank you for staying with me when I've been having some issues uh, uploading videos and do a schedule, but that is hopefully over for the foreseeable future. So I'll see you. It's very handy. Just say you run out of torches, like, oh, over to torches. You can find torches.